guys, happy terrific Tuesday. Yesterday I brought you a book that I borrowed from Zoe's personal library. Today I dug into Luke's to bring you a book about one of our favorite topics this year. Dinosaurs. I know how much fun we had learning about dinosaurs during our week unit on that. We read lots of fun things. We read fiction and nonfiction books. Now remember, fiction books are make-believe stories. They're stories that did not happen. A lot of times we have a character that is an animal who can talk, or we have maybe some kids, but it's something that we really have to use our imaginations and stretch to believe. Nonfiction those are books about true things. Those are our books that we read when we read about first aid, when we read about um, community helpers, and even some of our dinosaur books that we read before. So today, I'm going to read to you the story, How Do Dinosaurs Say I'm Mad? Now, when you just look, we see a dinosaur, we see a grown-up, kid and down here looks like a broken tricycle <clears throat> so just from looking at the cover art what do you think this book is do you think that it is fiction or do you think it is non-fiction all right let's open it up <clears throat> oh and look at this dinosaur look at him he's got his arms crossed his head is turned you can tell he is not happy. Oh, and look at all these dinosaurs. They are all in different levels of pitching a fit. Stomping their feet and yelling, rolling on the ground. Oh, my word. I know that none of you act like that. Oh, and look at this T-Rex. Oh, look, he is up there he is yelling Ooh. how do dinosaurs act when he's mad how does dinosaur act when he's mad <clears throat> does he roar slam the door yell at mom and dad When he can't get his way, does he boast, I'll be bad? Is that what dinosaurs say when they're mad? When Papa says no, does he grumble and pout? When Mama says no, does he throw toys about? When he's told to sit still, does he kick at a chair? Does he act as if mother and father aren't there? When he hears, take a nap, does he give dirty looks? When he's told, quiet down, does he rip up his books? No cookies today. Fling a mug at the cat. Time for bed. Does he bang on the floor with his bat? <clears throat> no, a dinosaur doesn't. He counts up to 10. Then after a timeout, breathes calmly. And then he cleans up his mess and he picks up the mug. He says, 
I am so sorry. He gives a big hug. His anger is gone. So he opens the door. Not mad. I'm so glad. Little dinosaur. I hope you guys enjoyed that book. And while I was reading, I hope you were thinking about whether or not this book was fiction or nonfiction. If you guess fiction, you are correct. This is a make-believe story. Because do dinosaurs live in the house with mom and dad? No, they don't. But it's fun to pretend. So make sure you're not acting like a mad dinosaur. And then instead, you're being the sweet dinosaur from the end. And I will see you guys back tomorrow. Have a wonderful day.